Hi, my name is Winter and I have a message for Matt Damon. The Matt Damon who acts in movies like the Jason Bourne series, Oppenheimer, my personal favorite, The Martian. So if you're Matt Damon, I have good news for you. If you're not Matt Damon, please scroll along. This message isn't for you. So if you're Matt, you probably remember coming here back in 2010. And what happened then is I hear that you were near the Makale University area, Makale area, and uh, that's in northern Ethiopia. I'm all the way here in the capital city, but that's not relevant. When you were there, there were a group of students who heard that you arrived here and they thought, oh my goodness, let's go try to see Matt Damon. And the one who's telling me the student, this story is someone called Hermela, uh, decided to go to follow the trail of the rumor of where you were. And so Hermela and her friends from Makale University went out and came to the site where you were working with your organization, water.org. When she came there, I don't think she met you, but she told me that, or told us, that she saw something that would change the trajectory of her life, really. She saw people come from far away to get water from a very shallow water source there that was dirty, and she just thought to herself, there is no way people are gonna drink this water. Like, that's just, there's just no way. And even when she was telling us the story, all these years later, like, she would just she was brought to tears. She had no idea it was really this bad. She grew up in an urban area where, yes, they would get water from buckets and, you know, they would have to use a container and stuff sometimes, like we do here in Addis as well. But she didn't know that it got this bad, not too far away from where she lived really. So she just thought, if people are coming from all the way there, from other countries, to do something about this, to help people meet this very basic need, there has to be something I can do. So that's when Hermela and her friends founded the Drop of Water organization. So they started digging wells and uh, working with communities all over Ethiopia. I've met the people from the organization. They actually held a training program for their own staff and also for people who, me and a friend of mine who work in another organization called Alliance for Building Communities, so I'm just an architect and a visual artist. I had, I don't know much about the nonprofit world. So they held this training and we found out they've worked with, it's the numbers, 30,000 beneficiaries. It's just wild to me for such a small organization, such a tiny but very passionate team. So I don't know if you want to check out what they do. They have a website, dropofwater.org. They have an international and local contact. But I'm making this video, uh, Matt, because if I were you, I would have loved to know that something I did inadvertently caused such a positive ripple effect that would go on to continue to affect people all these years later. And Hermela doesn't know I'm making this video, but they were such a cool, passionate group of people. And I thought, this could, just knowing that you know, would probably make her day and maybe also bring a little attention to this organization that I believe is doing such really good work. And so, yeah, that's it for me. The other organizations I mentioned are also in the description box. And yeah, that's it. Take care. Bye.